Isaiah. And let's, let's begin with a word of prayer. Our God and our Heavenly Father, we do thank you for this time that we have to uh, reflect and meditate upon your word and think of uh, the importance of the book of Isaiah in your holy word. We just pray that your spirit would teach us. Father, help us to marvel at your word. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Well, this is a very long book. Uh, the book of Isaiah, 66 chapters. We're not going to go through it verse by verse. This is really going to be a bird's eye view, Lord willing. And perhaps the best place to start is the author of the book is Isaiah. Uh, despite some opposition from liberals, it's pretty much a settled fact that Isaiah wrote Isaiah. <laughs> he said so. And just a few words about the man. We don't know an awful lot about uh, his life, uh, but we know that he lived during the reign of four kings, Uzziah, Jotham, uh, Azat, Ahaz, and Hezekiah. And he ministered a little over four, 700 years before Christ, seven centuries before Christ. And he was a contemporary of other prophets at the time, Amos, Hosea, and Micah, and of all the prophets, Isaiah, by many, is considered to be the greatest, the greatest of the, of the prophets. And sometimes the, the book that he wrote, the book of Isaiah, is called, this isn't the real title, but many refer to it as the gospel according to Isaiah.